Hadi, let's start off by speaking personally for you. What a moment to score those two goals within six minutes of each other, 13 minutes into the game. Brilliant. Talk us through those. Uh, yeah, I mean, as most of the fans know, pre-season, it didn't really work out for me in front of goal, but I always knew if I get in the positions that, you know, they will go in. And um, I had way easier chances in pre-season, but, you know, I told everyone when it mattered, hopefully it goes in. And um, thankfully today it went in. I worked hard for it. And it's only the start, though, one game. I got to do it throughout the whole season and onto Halifax next week. But yeah, felt really good and very happy to be off the mark. Well, as you say there, it's all about doing it when it matters, doesn't mm -hmm. it? And that was certainly the case today. I mean, the first goal, great powerful finish. Second goal, talk us through that because it looked like it had a deflection, but it wasn't, was it? That was just no. a brilliant chip, wasn't it? Yeah, I mean, I know when JB gets on the turn, on the half turn, just to peel off the centre half because I don't want to block his space. So when he passed me the ball, I knew it was coming. I just focused on getting the first touch right. And then the second one, I was in the box. So I said, let me be positive and tried to take it on my left. But my other touch was bad. So I thought, let me just, you know, give it a little thing with my right. And uh, didn't, didn't take a deflection and luckily went in. So, yeah, it was, uh, it was a great feeling, that one. And you ran straight, well, the first goal, you ran straight over to the bench there. Was, what, what was that? What was the thinking behind that? The gaff has been... Um, taking the mick about me not being able to score. So um, it was just a bit of a thank you and a bit of a there you go for me, you know, putting the, putting it away when it mattered. So um, a bit of a thank you and a there you go, Gaffer. So, yeah. And looking longer term as well for you, it's it, it has been a bit of a struggle since you've come to Aldershot with injuries. It's been tough, hasn't it? Especially last season. So was that a real, real nice moment for you to, to finally put that to bed a bit? Yeah, I mean, I worked hard with all the staff, Liam, Brad, Jonathan, Hugo, Rich, all the management team, you know, over pretty much one year now. Mm. Um, so even just today, it feels really good to be off the mark and, you know, repay a bit of the faith that they've shown in me. Um, you know, the club brought me in when I had no club. So to be able to, to, you know, produce today feels really good, albeit one game, but hopefully that can set me off for the rest of the season. You spoke about having that link with JB for the second goal, Kai as well behind you there. And, and alongside you sometimes. Are you, are you beginning to form a nice little partnership with those guys? Yeah, I mean, we work on it a lot in training. Um, we do a lot of shape stuff and patterns just to make it kind of automatic. Um, obviously, I've been at the club with JB since last year as well, mm. so I know how he plays. I know what he can do. I know he can find me whenever, wherever I am. So, yeah, and with Kai as well, um, he's been in pretty early from pre-season. So, you know, just forming that partnership in training and executing on a game day. So it um, felt good to get a pass off JB and score because uh, he gave me a bit of stick last week <laughs> about not um, not scoring off his passes but um, now I'm happy and uh, yeah work on it a lot in training so yeah. You know all about the competition up front obviously with Laurent up scoring as many goals and Jack as well scoring so many goals and Jack's coming back from injury himself is that something that drives you on to, to perform better and, and helps you yeah, perform? Yeah I mean the gaffer always says we want to win as a team it doesn't matter who scores but as a striker on a personal level everyone will tell you they want to score um, you know, the competition is fierce. Last year it was very fierce and, you know, you've got to stake your claim in the team. If you're not uh, one week, the next you could be not. So you've got to play every game like it's your last. And yeah, the competition is great. It drives us all and I think it brings the best out of us. And the goals will be talked about a lot, but you bring a lot more to the side, don't you? I mean, for 90 minutes there, you were just giving it your all, harrying the defenders there, winning balls back high up the pitch. Is that something that you, you, you take pride in your performances? Yeah, I mean, I always speak with my dad. Would I rather play well and play, and play well and not score, or score and not play well? But yeah. I think I'd take playing well because you can tell football is good or bad. I mean, I don't want to just be known to, for just scoring goals. Obviously, they're nice, and you know, you get a bit of stick if you're not scoring. But the goals are, you know, I love love like running around, holding the ball up, bringing other players into play, linking with my tens, Kai, Josh, James, whoever it is today, James. I take a lot of pride in, you know, harrying the defence, running in behind, getting the team up the pitch. Something I've worked a lot on and um, hopefully it can continue. An assist for James as well. Yeah. So two goals and assist, it's really something to, to take away from this game, isn't it? Yeah. And yeah, and, and looking ahead to the rest of this season, I mean, it's very early days, but a, a very credible draw there against a the side that will probably be challenging, won't it? Yeah, I mean, as a collective, we're from front to back. You know, we don't want to concede three goals, especially at home. You know, it starts from the front. Um, but you know we'll take the draw before the game I think over the balance of the game maybe we edged it I thought we played well in general apart from a little spell end of the first half and start of the second when we conceded but we'll take the draw uh, as the gaffer said up there you know we're off the mark with a point 
So hopefully we can kick on next week.